Referencing is one of the most important academic skills at university. For many students, learning to reference is a completely new practice and it may take some time to get to grips with. Others of you may have had experience with referencing before, which will certainly help, but be aware that different universities may require referencing to be done in different ways and if you've studied somewhere other than UWS before, it is important to be aware of what style you will need to employ here. This will be covered in the accompanying video, How to Reference. But before we get to that, I want to give you an overview of why you need to reference and why it is such an important skill to grasp. Ultimately, referencing is an academic convention and is used in academic writing across the globe. One of the main reasons for its existence is that for any reader of a piece of work, it helps make the distinction between an author's own thoughts and the ideas or words that come from other sources. As a university student, of course, you will be expected to read and you will also be expected to include references to important ideas and theories from your particular subject thus demonstrating evidence of this reading. Like a paper trail, using references helps any kind of marker see where these ideas have come from and allows them the chance to find these original sources if they so desire. This then ties in with another crucial reason for referencing in your work, avoiding plagiarism. Plagiarism occurs when a writer claims other people's words or ideas as their own. Good referencing allows a reader to see where ideas are being taken or developed from other sources, with credit being given to original authors for their work. Along with good paraphrasing, referencing will help a student steer clear of any plagiarism issues. Any direct quotations used should be put in quotation marks and of course referenced properly. Ultimately, there is a very simple answer to the question why do you have to reference at university? And that is, you just have to. As I said, referencing is an academic convention and this is not something you can get around if you want to get the best possible marks in your assignment, of course. Some marking criteria at UWS will feature a proportion of the marks dedicated to referencing alone. Even if this is not the case, using referencing is intertwined with good academic writing and the importance of evidence in critical writing. And good use of referencing will bolster the standard of your academic written work. Many students ask at this point how many references they need to have in a paragraph or in an assignment. There of course is no set answer to this and this may depend on which section of the assignment you are working on or the type of assignment itself. Something like a literature review maybe by its very nature, feature a significant number of references, but a reflective piece less so. Although with the latter, it's also a good idea to show evidence of reading. In general, students find that they are expected to include more references in their writing than they initially anticipated at the start of a course. However, there are cases where references do not need to be given for example, reporting back on one's own primary research. Also, what can be assumed to be general knowledge does not need to be referenced, but this can sometimes not always be clear cut. If in doubt about whether to put a reference in, it is always better to do so to be on the safe side. It is important to be aware as well that appropriate referencing applies not only to written work, but also to spoken assessments as well, such as presentations, where references can be displayed on visual aids such as PowerPoint. Referencing is perhaps the only area of academic skills where there are some rules to follow rather than just advice, and learning how to format your referencing will be covered in the accompanying video, How to Reference. Remember that you can always book an appointment with an academic skills advisor to talk about referencing through the student app or our website.